Hi, my name is Samir Saini. Uh, I'm from a company called Shears Interactive, which is a global partner for the Airbus uh, Technology Licensing Initiative. Uh, we have partnered with uh, uh, Mazak Europe uh, to actually integrate the Delta NFS technology, which is from the Airbus Group, onto the Mazak machine platforms. So this uh, technology is a uh, next generation uh, friction stow welding technology, which we have uh, integrated onto the machine in collaboration with Mazak in order to provide a value added benefit to a customer to have a friction stow welding uh, process as well as a machining process into one platform itself. Uh, in the past, of course, uh, friction stow welding is not very new. Uh, it's been around for the last uh, 10 to 15 years. But generally, the, the machines on which it was integrated is quite expensive and not easily accessible by the general market. Uh, and with this integration on uh, a machine platform like the VCS 430, uh, we have tried to make this technology much more accessible uh, to the, the general market. Um, and of course, uh, it, it has the benefits of uh, allowing a customer to do machining as well as joining of all kinds of aluminum alloys, uh, dissimilar materials like intermetallic combinations, and even aluminum and thermoplastic, which is a current need in um, the transportation sector as a whole. So, so the Delta NFS technology is different from the conventional friction stir welding in the fact that we have a non-rotating shoulder and only a rotating pin. And this has many benefits in the fact that uh, the qu quality of the weld is much better uh, the heat affected zone is much smaller and the overall downward process force required is much lower. So uh, the reason why uh, it makes sense to integrate on a CNC machine is because a CNC machine provides uh, the process force required for the process. So this technology cannot be integrated on say a, a MIG or TIG welding machine. You need a machine which can generate process force. And hence uh, we have been working with uh, Mazak for some time uh, to integrate the technology. Uh, about three years ago, uh, the decision was taken internally uh, to have a technology licensing initiative because Airbus has over 10,500 technologies and innovations which are backed by more than 37,000 uh, live and granted patents. And uh, it makes a lot of sense to uh, have this technology now accessible to the world. And this was, I, I can't quote an exact figure, but it is. Uh, it, it, it's very close to the, the base price of the VCS machine, the already existing platform, uh, within about uh, 10 to 15 percent, uh, a little higher than the base version of the VCS machine. So of course the technology which is Delta NFS can join all types of aluminum alloys together. It can also join aluminum to dissimilar materials like aluminum to steel, aluminum to titanium, uh, aluminum to copper or brass as well. And uh, we also have some success in joining copper to copper, but uh, that's not tested on this uh, particular platform as yet. Uh, but those are the general kinds of uh, material combinations. Also the possibility of joining aluminum to uh, carbon fiber reinforced thermoplastic uh, could also be possible.